that's why I don't understand how anybody could do like like uh, ketamine. Like people that do like recreational ketamine. Never done it. Never done it either. But Scary. apparently you go into that K-hole that yeah. they talk about. It like, doesn't sound good. K-hole doesn't sound good. That doesn't sound good to me. I don't want to do that. It's some sort of animal tranquilizer, right? Yeah. Something, you know. If, Thanks, brother. What is thank it? Thank you. What is it? Um, what it's was just, it if it wasn't, or if it wasn't called K-hole, if it was called uh, Wonderlust, if something was called Wonderlust, I'd be like, let me try it. Yeah, but they call it a K-hole after they've been in it. Yeah, it sounds horrible. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like darkness. I don't want to go there. I never Did had the stuck? desire to do something that was going to put you in a K-hole. Fuck that. Like acid, not into it. I, we did that acid podcast with Joey. Mm -hmm. I didn't think I can go. That was the only guy not on acid. But Ari was on acid. Joey, um, Lee, <laughs> it was fucking hysterical. I was. I was like, I, you got to change the name. You can't call it acid. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna take anything called acid. That fucks me up. That's hilarious. And he, they should have called it something else. They should have saw if they just call it cutie love. Yeah. You want some cutie love? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'll take some cutie love. What's it going to do? Oh, I'll just make you look at yourself All the way everybody else looks yeah, at you. Yeah. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but Joey would drop some ass. He didn't give a fuck, man. <laughs>